Back to, we are at the Eagle Town Park once again, Quiet Cat, kind of off in the distance now, Jeremy Gross taking front and center stage, literally. Yeah. Now, what's up? Nothing. How are you? I'm good. We saw you here last week. You were doing a little, um, we were playing some polo on the Quiet Cats. We're kind of, we're going to get you back here next week for some jousting, I think, or some sword fighting with the pool noodles. In between now and then, like, what's, what's going on with Eagle? I know we're kind of winding down the busy summer activities. Show downtown is wrapped up, um, but there's still some more stuff going on. Yeah, so we do have one more week of yoga in the park um, right here on this stage. Opportunity to come out and do some donation-based yoga. Uh, it's a great turnout. We have, you know, 150, 200 people out here doing yoga, so, you know, you really feel the the soul and the energy of the park um, just through all of the yogis. Uh, so awesome activity. Um, one more weekend of that, uh, Sunday at 9.30. Um, going off of Yoga in the Park, Yoga Fest is coming up next month um, by Yoga Off-Broadway as well. So another group of great instructors and teachers um, to lead you through your practice and um, some really cool and fun things with music and DJs and, and all sorts of uh, different yoga styles um, at that event. So Yoga Fest, is it a one-day thing or is it a weekend event? How long does it go for? It's a weekend event, um, the weekend of September 29th, um, which will be after September Fest. Um, so another thing coming up. <laughs> and we talked about this weeks ago, all the different fests, the festivals, and basically they're just gatherings in the local communities to kind of bring everybody together to celebrate something or just to see friends. So September Fest, what's on the docket for that? So September Fest is a new event in Eagle this year. Um, it's basically the bookend to summer, um, the bonfire block party being the, the other end of the bookend. Um, free music uh, in downtown Eagle Ranch. It'll be two days of live music. Uh, we've got Andrews Osborne, Fruition, March 4th, uh, Bonfire Dub, The Broadcast, um, great lineup. There'll be bands after the shows at uh, Bonfire, or at um, Dusty Boot and Seven Hermits as well. Uh, so tons of music and some really fun bands. Uh, definitely check out March 4th on YouTube. Um, they're they're going to be incredible to watch. And what are the dates of that again? September 22nd and 23rd. So we're one month out. So then that weekend and then Yoga Fest after that, the following weekend. And then it doesn't just kind of go sleeper down here, Eagle, for the wintertime, does it? I feel like there's, there's always things happening. Granted, the wintertime days are shorter. It's colder. You can't get out there and do as many things as you can in the summer. But um, sure, you can. It's called a jacket. See? Okay, good. That's what I was teasing you for. So, anything planning? You guys have any stuff kind of tentatively talked about for the winter time? So we are looking at some new events. Um, just some community things that will be going on right here in this park. We put uh, two different ice rinks. Um, just free outdoor. Come and play anytime you want. Um, outdoor ice rinks. And have you done that in the past or is this something new? Okay. Yeah, that's been happening for a couple of years now. Um, we'll have uh, Twelfth Night is always a fun celebration of uh, the end of the holiday season. <laughs> Burn all the Christmas trees right here in Town Park. Um, but yeah, there's, there's always a ton of stuff going on in Eagle, so make sure to check out eagleoutside.com. Um, just between now and September Fest, there's a bunch of stuff I didn't have time to mention, but uh, the Red Ribbon Music Project. Um, yeah, eagleoutside.com. That's where you get all the info. Such good activities. All right, one more yoga this Sunday right. right here. What time is that at? 9.30 a.m. And then we have September Fest, the 23rd, the weekend of the 23rd in September, weekend of the 29th, just more yoga. Yep. And just we just need to bring people down to, to Eagle and experience Bonfire. Go to Moe's. Go explore. Go enjoy the community. If you're passing on through, spend an hour, um, you'll want to come back again for sure. Yeah, and you know, stop by Quiet Cat, get one of those to tour around town. Um, it's a small town, pretty flat. You don't need a Quiet Cat, but it's a lot of fun. Nobody needs a Quiet Cat, but everybody wants to have one. Thanks, Jeremy. Thank you. All right, we're taking a quick break. We got an epic morning coming up. We got a trail report from Ashley coming up next too.